Hi YouTube, so the DMM Kinesi Harness is finally here after a long time waiting. Feels like it was years ago since we uh, this was announced that it was coming out, so finally it's here. Wanted to do a, a unboxing of the harness, um, or I guess I should say uh, unbagging of the harness, as it comes in this nice little neat little bag. Uh, I don't think I'll be storing my um, harness in this bag, but um, could be good for, I don't know. I'll probably use it for mountain biking and throwing all my dirty clothes in there at the end of the day because it looks like you could probably, the material, you could probably actually throw that in the washer as well. But anyway, let's get into the vid. So I'll get into the bag, obviously it's still got these plastic fastenings on so I've not been into it yet so I'll just um Oh they went flying everywhere. So yeah, this bag is really nice. Anyway, let's get the harness out and have a look at that. Oh, there's actually quite a bit in here. So obviously you got the harness. I'll just put this down there. Wow. That's uh, really, really nice. Anyway, what else can you get? There's ah, two stowaways. We've got two stowaways for free. Hold on. Oh, and the large one. So there's two, three, three large stowaways. I guess these might be just the bolts for them or something. Anyway, let's open it up. See what's in there. Yeah, some bolts, I guess. Not 100% sure what they're for. We'll get to the manual eventually, but anyway, there's the nuts and bolts. Oh, they might be for the uh, bridge. That's what it looks like. And then, then a little Kinesi sticker. Well, obviously then we've got, put the bag to one side. We've got a Kinesi Max sit harness. Manual. So yeah, sweet. Let's uh, let's get a closer look at the harness then. Okay, so a quick uh, recap. Obviously, you got the harness. Uh, there's three stowaways in there. So I'll put them to one side. Then you got some bolts to uh, change out the bridge, I guess, when it gets to that time. Um, so the harness itself, it's weight-wise, nah. Yeah, it's not too bad, not really much different to the, um, I guess I'm going to have to say, the tree motioning weight-wise. So I guess that's probably the best comparison. Um, I'd say the back pad looks bigger though. Looks a bit bigger, a bit more to it. Obviously you've got your attachment here for your chainsaw. Everything really, really good quality. Seems really good. Quite like these, obviously all DMM hardware. Lovely. Everything just got that load, little final little bits of touches. You got it down onto the lower Ds. And then one of the key features on the Kinesi Max, the adjustable rope bridge. So you have to just pull it through. I have to say though, the, uh, that is one long rope bridge. So it's probably gonna be around there, isn't it? For me, I'll probably have to daisy chain that up or something for now. Um, I've been told you don't cut these, so whatever you do, do not cut these and just tie your own knot. Um, because of this stitching on the end, it's part of it. So whatever you do, don't cut your rope bridge. Um, come through, and then you just flick it up to... That's sweet, that's such an easy dine. It's so simple, but... Right? One ring on here. There's nothing on the other bridge, so I'll, have to, I'll probably put my um, little camp gyro on that one. Obviously we got the buckles, red, nice. So Cobra, pro style, that's what it says. Yeah, very nice, clean, clean action that. I'm not sure if that's the same as what's on the Teufelberger or not. 
But yeah, really nice little demon there. Medium, I've got so this here, so this is a size medium. So hopefully it fits. Then we've got the little tag with the date. Oh, yeah, so we got the waist. It says 75 to 102 centimeters, as you can see there. Hopefully. Obviously, you got the leg loops, you got those little, these little things as well to just to clip on, hold it in place. But yeah, really nice. Obviously, got these little finishing touches here with the uh, stoppers. So when you adjust it, you can cut them off and then move them where to where you want it. It says in all the instructions, and I have to say the manual itself does look really good. There's actually a lot of uh, detail in there, information, so we should be able to get all the information we need out of that. So yeah, so there's, I guess, the first look, unboxing of the DMM Kinesi harness. So I guess next video will be, I'll have it already set up, I will, from my harness and I'll, uh, I'll get in the tree with it and yeah, see what I think. Um, looks really good, really good. Obviously I have to talk a little bit about the, um, the price. So I, I got this from Honey Brothers and it was, um, what is it, 650? Um, is that before VAT? After VAT. In so that's including VAT. 650 including VAT. That's a, a great British pounds for anyone that's uh, not in the UK. So yeah, it's a little bit more than rest, but looking now and seeing it, I think the quality just outweighs that. And obviously everything is just looks very well finished. So yeah, no, I'm super excited to give this a go. Um, like I always go for quality really over anything i'm gonna give this a go and uh see how we get on with it so yeah if you like the vid give it a like comment what you think if you're gonna get a harness you're gonna get a kinesi max um but yeah let me know if you're gonna get one or not and what you think of it yourselves yeah i'll uh i'll see you in the trees i guess